something. Mm-hmm. You actually have something to look forward to. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Who you got? Cream. Wow. You actually said that? Wow. Well, not only... You don't think is... the Abbott has any... Wow. Wow. Okay. Well, number one, Prem is my family, by the way. Like, Prem is my music. He's my music family. Right. So even if he stood no shot in this, right. I would be saying Prem because I'm okay. biased. Now, he just so happens to have 40 years of hits or music or 35 years of music to pull from. I don't think this is the best matchup. For I think this is going to... And RZA, RZA is RZA. Right. Like, I don't want people to think that I don't understand who RZA is. RZA is right. RZA. Right. But I think Preem is on the Mount Rushmore of producers, and and it's going to be tough. But haven't you learned just by watching what you've seen on the battles? It's more about the. It's not just about the beats that you're playing. It's the the chronological order of the beats that you're playing and other yeah. things. The personality. There's, there, there's a reason that. Cream is the only producer to work with Hove, Nas, Biggie, and Drake, and J. Cole. Mm. There's a reason for that. Listen, I see your motherfuckers' comments because I could look at you and see Low Key talking about I look like a ghost because I don't have any makeup on. Joe just called me and I wasn't. No, nah, Kim looked good. Kim used Kim used to run around looking good over at the source, man. I appreciate that, Joe. Yeah, no, you did. You did. I'm happy to see you. I miss you, too. I don't miss working with you. I'm really glad that that's probably done. But <laughs> Yo, you a liar. You love working with me. You love working with me. We've been doing this for years, whether it's the source, whether it's the slaughterhouse thing, whether what you love me being around. And I well, accept I, that well, I love not you. not going to admit that. Right. No, I love you. Right. Right. See, it's not I love you when we work here or I love you when we do this. I love you. That's so sweet. I may not necessarily love the capacity in which we have to work together, but that's all another. Right now, story. it wasn't. I've, I've had moments of bringing you water on stage, all types of shit. Yeah. Like I've been a Joe supporter and of your career, right? So. Yeah, but now you're tasked with figuring out where the Joe and Sin story goes next. Not just the Joe and Sin story. Everybody <laughs> has everybody has their own story. So it's not just it's not just the Joe and Sin story. Because there's a lot to Joe. Joe is very multi layered. And so yeah. when Joe wants to come home to love and hip hop, <laughs> show the world <laughs> how multi layered he is. I, I will be waiting I in front of, of my you. Thank you, Kim. We love you. Good seeing you. Bye. Get back to my transcribing. <laughs> uh, with my girl looked at me like she looks at you. All right, where we at? Where we at? Who we got? 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 What we got? What do?